Lisa. Followed by Kelly. Kelly Rowland. Kelly. Here she comes, bless her heart, after her triumph last weekend. And the one and only Mr. Gary Barlow. And now quickly followed by... I hope the stage in there is better than this. <laughs> it's just a fraction bigger. It's a bit bigger. A bit bigger. And now the, uh, the artists who are in the final. First of all, Little Mix. Come on, girls. Fresh from their success in the northeast. And for Kelly, Amelia Lilly. Fresh from her success in the northeast also. And for Gary, Marcus. Come on in, Marcus. Okay, well that gives you all the intros here. Um, we're gonna start with, we, I know we're all, we're all pushed for time here. Um, so, I'm not sure if I'm going to be handling the Q&A or not, or whether one of our girls, Karen, is going to do it. So I'll throw you over to Karen. Um, we've only got about 15 minutes. Please turn your mobile phones off. We'll answer as many questions as we can. Uh, enjoy, and thank you all for being here. Thank you. Karen. Gary, first, for yeah. a bit of a welcome, and to go past all the judges into Dermot, to have a quick word about the finals and stuff. Okay. Well, this is it, everybody. Uh, biggest X Factor final ever, Wembley Arena. Uh, I think we've got about 12,000 people in. Um, this is a, a big shift for these contestants to go from a TV studio to an arena in one week. Um, it's going to be a big challenge. Uh, it's going to be very exciting. Um, we have, uh, for the first time ever, we have the three judges duetting with their acts on Saturday night. Thank God Louis didn't get an act in the final. Um, <laughs> just out of interest, Louis, who would have done your duet had you had an act in the final? I don't know. You mean who would sing with? You'd have brought maybe one of your acts in? Or... Yeah, I think Johnny and I would have been a good duet. <laughs> what was your son, Louis? Uh, we were thinking of, the, you remember Renee and Renata? <laughs> Same here now. <laughs> um, so that's very exciting, that's Saturday night. And then on Sunday night we have an array of guests. Coldplay, Michael Bublé, we have um, Westlife. Westlife, JLS, <laughs> One Direction, and I've missed somebody else. Leona Lewis. Leona Lewis. So that's going to be amazing on Sunday night. And then obviously the winner will be crowned uh, very last thing on Sunday. That's Absolutely. the way it works, isn't it? <laughs> um, and I think that's it. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to say a few words about Marcus, Gary, at all? Uh, talk about the to, about Marcus. Yeah, he's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> he's behind me. I've got to say, no, he's been, it, it's been an amazing experience. My first year as being a judge. Um, I couldn't have wished for, for a, actually a better category, all, all my categories were great. In, in particular Marcus, the way he's grown throughout the competition has been amazing, it's been an absolute pleasure to deal with, it was an amazing homecoming yesterday in Liverpool, um, that Marcus's mum's out with a baby on me knee and his nana and granddad giving me stick <laughs> from the side, it was fantastic and the whole of Liverpool were out yesterday, um, it was just a brilliant evening. And um, it kind of made it all worthwhile for me, I must say. Um, and so on Saturday night, we're going to sing a Billy Joel classic together, Always a Woman. Um, and actually, um, Marcus, I know you're dedicated to your mum on Saturday night, which is, which is amazing. She's been, I know she's been really important in your life. Um, and so um, it's going to be an emotional evening, I think, for us. So we're looking forward to that. Thank you. 